So right now it's just a little bit stressful because there's been a slight change of plan due to time constraints. Uh, one of the locations that we were planning on going today is a little bit further than we wanted and yada yada yada. But it should all work out. Our concept is, to, is being prepared to be unprepared and making it look like we're doing some spontaneous shoot but we just have like just 15 different pieces of equipment to make it happen. It's just <laughs> ridiculous thinking about it. It's it's the beauty of like every travel video. It's like, oh, this spontaneous trip. I'm like, it's bullshit. It's like, whoa, this dude went out there with just a camera? It's like, nah, he has a drone, a camera, like a crew. <laughs> Six man <laughs> production team. <laughs> setting up the, the Ronin at the moment so that we can get some really nice stable shots. Let's go in here quickly. We'll get our lighting right. Because that's basically set up there. The starting concept for this one is that Corey shows up on a booster board because um, he's going on a spontaneous trip um, and he's booster boarded all the way out to the Warped Pines. Um, in this story, um, he's going to show up and then I don't know, take some photos. It is just literally rows and rows of giant trees. Yeah, this is something that I'm super, super fucking excited for. Um, but right now we're just trying to find, I guess, the perfect spot to set up um, for the shoot that we're about to do. What we're thinking is because this is a nice like straight strip, we're going to have the drone flying either all the way backwards or all the way forwards. And then we'll have a couple of decline shots that's going to show me taking some photos, but it's also going to show the treetops and probably have the sun piercing through to give it like that nice cinematic effect. Um, and then we're going to take some photos. We, I don't think we're allowed to set up the tent, but I just know that if we can get a couple of shots with it up, it's going to look so good. So we'll see how we go, but those are the two main shots that we need from here. shot we're about to get now we've set the tent up in the actual forest and this is how you get the perfect Instagram travel shot. Let go! This is so sick. Oh, look at this. Oh, can we just stop? Holy shit. This horse shot that I'm about to get. How gorgeous is this? So, literally, as we were just driving past and I was leaning out of the car, um, all these horses um, that we wanted to shoot with earlier, they ran away into the fields, but they were just all back, and that was gorgeous. 
It's now a couple weeks later. Corey's finished up all the editing for the video and you get to see it now. So enjoy. Lifestyle 150 is lightweight and suits my on-the-go lifestyle. With its 200 plus hours of rechargeable battery, no matter where I am, I'm always going to have power. All right, so how did you find the video? Uh, we really enjoyed making it and Corey and I had a lot of fun doing all the filming and making all the content. There was a lot of time constraints that we had, um, but overall we're really happy with um, the photos and the videos that came out of it. Uh, and I had a lot of fun making this behind the scenes video. So if this is something that you um, enjoyed or like to see the kind of behind the scenes workflow, uh, let me know below because I'd love to make a couple more of these. Um, maybe across a, different, a couple of different genres because we film across fitness and fashion and lifestyle. So if that's something that you want to see, uh, I'd love to make some more stuff. If you enjoyed the video, maybe consider giving it a like and subscribing, but if not, it's your choice. Until next time, have a great day.